One of the gems to our community is Olympic College. And Allison Smith is here with us this morning to talk about some of the offerings. Good morning. Good morning, guys. Good morning. You're both looking very dapper this oh, morning. Oh, well, thank you. you. Know, it's a Monday. Wore a you should, shirt today. should see us on Friday. <laughs> it's sweatpants and tank tops. That's how we, you know, you got to start the week off strong. How's it going? How you doing? We're doing great at Olympic College, Shelton. We're winding up our summer quarter and just gearing up for fall, which, of course, course is our, our our most popular quarter but, for sure um yeah things are going great for us anything new coming down the pike i know we have i got a tour coming up next week on the 22nd we're going to vance creek do the rail riders oh that's and cool. lunch as well so it's a whole day of uh, transportation from the college out to uh mill five basically vance creek and would do that pedal power awesome tour of uh, uh, parts of Mason County that a lot of people haven't gotten a That's chance so cool. to see. It's a lot of fun to do and I would say Besides mildly to strenuous. Hang out with you, oh, Jeff. yeah, that's a lot of fun, I guess, <laughs> for some really folks cool. that can <laughs> razz me about things we talk about here on the air. We yeah. always get good uh, listeners to come on in. So that's something that folks can sign up for now uh, through the continuing education, the community education. And you can find that olympic.edu and go to Shelton classes and uh, programs and classes. Continuing education is a great place to, to find. No, not that one. It's the community education classes there. We put the links in the show notes, and we'll do that. That's and a we, fun and one. And we have some exciting uh, exciting things coming down the pike with that. We're, we're hiring some new art teachers that are going to do some great uh, zero-credit community education art. And, um, and of course, the tours that, that you... Uh, help us with have been very successful we've had a lot of fun yeah we've had a lot of people that have enjoyed them so um in addition to that uh coming down the pike we are uh hoping to start our construction trade certificate nice spring quarter we're in the process of looking to hire a director to get that program off the um up and running and uh Eventually, you know, the hope is to expand that to uh, different trades. But we're starting with the carpentry, and uh, I think that'll be great. We've we've done a wonderful job over the last decade or so of encouraging everyone to, towards a four-year degree, mm -hmm. and we've been very successful with that. But the skilled trades people are are sorely lacking as i'm sure you know if you've ever tried to ha find a plumber yeah yeah um so that that's one of the things that we're working towards and i really think that it will attract a lot of people from all around the county i heard you talk at an education lunch in the chamber put on and it was pretty fascinating about that kind of the push for the four-year degree and that how it has been and still is prevalent but the trades i mean you're right you, uh, everybody is looking for a good competent uh, electrician or a plumber or someone that they could call in the middle of the night because something's broken and um, those jobs and that type of job has really dipped and if you're good at that position a lot of times, after you're done you with your certificate, really you money. can make a ton of money. Yeah. Uh, you know, and it, all it takes is a couple fixes here and there, and then word of mouth spreads like, mm -hmm. like wildfire, right. and your exactly. your phone's off the hook, and you're kind of determining your own schedule at certain points. Mm -hmm. Well, and right now, you know, they because it's so hard to find the skilled labor, they can pretty much charge anything they want. Yeah. And um, so I, I think a lot of people would truly be interested that, you know, working with their hands and being outdoors and um, I think it's a great opportunity. That's the other thing, too, is there's a lot of freedom and flexibility in, you know, you're not stuck necessarily in a cubicle mm -hmm. for right. nine hours a day or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. It's almost like radio, except for the money part. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Very true. Isn't it true? You're very, it's very true. You were oh, also boy. saying in that conversation about the uh, long-term earning potentials versus somebody that decides and feels it's necessary to stay in like a four-year college and get your MBA or something like that. So you come out of that with tons of student debt, and it takes you a long time to kind of break even, whereas these, these certifications, these two-year degrees 
They get well, you. and different people are, are are prone to different skills. So, so the point I was trying to make at, at the luncheon when I spoke was, you can go and you can get your four year degree or, or more and and have that student debt. But if it isn't what your natural skills are, you're not going to be terribly successful, you know, to climb the ladder. So, but if you're prone to be an electrician, you can be a very great electrician and and make more money than the person mm-hmm. with the four-year degree yeah. so you know it all it's it it depends from person to person the academic calendar is out now and people are still working on making sure that they have got the classes ready to go for them and uh, fall is just around the corner you can see the schedule and calendar at olympic.edu make sure you click on the uh, shelton link there and as well if you want to hang out, do some, have a fun day on the 22nd. That's my next tour, Vance Creek Rail Riders. You can find out more information uh, there on that one with the links in uh, the show notes here and the Shelton campus just up the road. Always looking good up there, too. Yeah, it is. It's, it is. We're looking pretty sharp. 432-5400, the phone number to sign up for that. Good to see you, Allison. Awesome. Great seeing you hey, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, th-